If you're wanting to stay healthy and happy this holiday season, Dr. Ken Patterson is here with advice for you. Thank you so much for being here today. Great to be here. Thank of, you, Claire. Of course. And so tell me a little bit, it's hard to stay healthy during the holidays. So what are some tips to keep, you know, on you your to, goals? You have to keep in mind the health risks that we have. There's three general categories of health risk that we face during the holidays. The first has to do with getting together with people. We travel a lot, therefore, an increased risk of cardio, uh, motor vehicle accidents. Uh, people are drinking, uh, they're driving fatigued, and you have to watch out for them. That's the first category. The second category is that we're just uh, in contact with a lot of people at parties, family gatherings, and so we're more likely to pick up an infectious disease, more likely to have colds and flus during that season. The second uh, category of illnesses and problems that we face is an exacerbation of chronic illnesses. This happens because uh, the stress, the bad diet, the lack of exercise of our lives go goes on, and so there's increased risk of heart attacks, strokes, and other chronic diseases during the holidays. And the third category of risk, health risk that we face, is the failure to take advantage of uh, the opportunity to change our health patterns. Uh, in investment, there's a term called opportunity cost, and I think the opportunity cost for not taking advantage of this opportunity to change your health patterns is high. Uh, what are you losing? What opportunity are you losing? Because you're not taking advantage of the opportunity to, to get on a healthy pattern. How can you take that opportunity to get on a healthy pattern? Well, you have to decide that's a priority for yourself, and you have to begin. And we'll talk in a minute maybe about starting early on New Year's resolutions. I think that's a good, good way to begin. And um, so what are some of the, your tips for when you go to parties and, you know, there's all sorts of food out there that right. isn't so healthy, drinks that aren't right. so healthy? So when you go to a party, first is know your situation. Know who's going to be there. Know what the situation's going to be. Is there going to be a lot of bad stuff uh, to eat? And prepare yourself ahead of time. One, drink some water before you go. Two, have a healthy snack. Uh, have something good for you, some vegetables or something that's really good for you. Eat that before you go. Don't go hungry. Third, if you have the opportunity, if it's appropriate, prepare a healthy meal or snack to take with you. Uh, that way you can have some of it when you're there and you can give other people an opportunity to eat well. And when you're at the party, when you arrive, don't start eating um, right away. Survey the situation and make a deal with yourself ahead of time. You're only going to eat two or three sweets or two or three bad things. Uh, and then sur survey the situation, decide what you want to get, and then put those things on your plate and eat only that. Don't get a second helping uh, and, and make those decisions ahead of time. The next thing that's the most important thing about making holiday parties a success is your mindset. Go expecting to have fun. Focus on relationships. Focus on the people that are there and how you relate to them. And don't just think about food all the time. Mm -hmm. And then you've talked about starting New Year's resolutions early. How do you do that? Well, New Year's resolutions, if you start on uh, no, uh, January 1 on the New Year's resolution, you have an 80% chance of failing. If you start early the holidays and you sort of begin to ramp up your activity in anticipation of your New Year's re resolution, you have a much higher chance of being successful. And so you have some seminars coming up talking about staying healthy and being active. What, what can you talk right, about? Right, so those? to get a head start on your New Year's resolution, we'd like to help you. And we're offering two special holiday seminars, Tuesday, December 5th, and uh, is it the 4th? <laughs> Tuesday next week and Wednesday of next week, we have two seminars at Natural Foods Restaurant. This will, this will be a great opportunity to begin to think ahead of time about how you want to live your life the next year. Perfect. Well, thank you so much for being here today. And if you would like to contact Dr. Patterson, his office is at 4601 Buffalo Gap Road in Suite B1. He has two seminars coming up. On December 4th, he'll talk about stress, hormones, and health. And on December 5th, he'll talk about type 2 diabetes and nutrition. Both seminars will be at Natural Food Restaurant 2534 South 7th. Reservations are required. You can do so by calling his office at 704-5069 or by going to RestoreWellnessCenter.com.